well. basketball on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr. And joining us a bit later from the sidelines, Doris Burke. He got Partizan, NIS Belgrade, taking on Shervena Svesta Telecom Belgrade. And it's Partizan now. Here's Westerman, guarded by Nelson. And Bogdanovich to Westerman. Loses his man off the screen and lays it up and in. Give an assist there, not for the pass, but for the solid screen set on the inside that freed him up and made the layup possible. Nelson from outside. The shot misses. And Partizan will go the other way with it. Here's Milosav Lajevic. Here's Milotinov. And it's rejected. Here's Marjanovic. Shot is off.
Here's Bogdanovich. Soft touch off the glass. Crafty pass work there, getting it down low for the easy deuce. Here's Nelson. They really want to find that igniter here. Yeah, that's right. They, Kevin, the offense has basically been running in place. They got to get going. And he gets it to go. And a lot of times his first quarter seems to dictate how big of a role he plays later on. And he's off to the good start. Let's find out what Doris Burke has for us. I caught up with the head coach for Partizan. He talked about what an even matchup this is and said he expected a very tightly contested game. When two teams are so alike, more often than not, it comes down to the very last moments or even a little bit of luck. We'll see if he's right, guys. All right, Doris, thanks. And guys, when you look at how these teams match up, do you feel this game is up for grabs? Oh, yeah, no question, Kevin. These teams are mirror images of each other in a lot of ways. And I think that adds a little extra emotion into the mix when you've got a competitor that's your mirror image. I mean, that always stirs things up a bit. Here's Marjanovic. A three-pointer off the mark. And they're now one for five to start this game, so having trouble finding any offensive rhythm. And Bogdanovich to Westerman. Down low. Uses the glass to finish the layup. They are really doing a nice job establishing a presence inside early. It's going to open things up for them on the perimeter going forward, Clark. Here's Nelson. There's the bucket. Good. Got to love the finger roll up and over the defense. Ortiz on leading by three. Here's Westerman. No good. Good D by Nelson. Now about three minutes gone in the first quarter. Off the mark and a bad shot there. And it's Partisan's ball. Here's Militinov, and he finishes nicely on the way. Really tough to get that shot off with the size differential there. That's not an individual matchup he's going to win every time, especially in the post. Very well done. I didn't think he had any business operating down there with the big fellas. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. Over to the wing. Here's Bogdanovich. Nelson with the rebound. Well, he won't miss many of those. Especially with the defender not in the best of positions there. They get the rebound. And yes, sir, that one drops. He has five. Boy, where was the box out? Too easy on that second chance opportunity. Yeah, no box out is what happened there. Those kind of mistakes on the glass will kill a team. Took him no time at all on that one. I don't know what's happening to their defense. I mean, they, they don't have any effort, any purpose. And it's really costing them. I mean, the last five baskets at that end have been on very easy looks. Now here's Jenkins. He's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. And the shot is good. He can be a forgotten man in their offense sometimes, but you know, the defense still needs to keep an eye on him. To the inside. A solo fast break. That almost feels like two buttons coming off the steal like it did. And especially the fact that it ties the game, Clark. The, the lead was about to be stretched out, and instead, we're right back to even. Here's Laverne. Misses the three. Laverne's gone one of three on the night. Great offensive performance they're putting on. You see the benefit of knocking down baskets consecutively because it leads to the confidence growing and growing, doesn't it, Steve? It sure does, and now it's to the point where they just feel unstoppable. Here's Radenovich. Good. And a nice assist from Nelson. Nelson's got three assists in the game. Here's Westerman. Inside. Here's Laverne. And he gets it to go. You know, when he's in that tight with that kind of height advantage over the defender, that's going to be a pretty easy play for him. Now, here is Nelson. Tight defense on him. Passes to Jenkins. And again, Sredenis Vesta with a triple. How about the passing? They are moving the ball without any thought, without any agenda. It's hard to overstate all the points they've scored on assist today. Beautiful to watch. There's a good screen. Here's Martino. Powered down after the assist. Let him into the lane. 
That's basketball 101, guys. I mean, elementary. Use the screen to free yourself and then take it straight to the rack. Yeah, very nice set play for him. Well, that's using your head and using your body. Misses the wing three. And it's Partizan now. They trail by one. Laverne passes to Bogdanovich. Off the pick. The shot is off. And Shervena is Vesta the other way now. Here's Nelson. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for Shervena is Vesta. Well, I'll tell you what, they must have had a good shoot around because they've been fantastic from long range so far, fellas. And they're also showing some muscle here in the first half, finding a lot of points in the paint area. Martizan trails by three. Here's Bogdanovich, the stupendous finish in traffic. Bogdanovich has got six. Really aggressive play, taking it to the rim against the big man. Tell you what, I love that fearless attitude. Nelson with it. Just five on the clock. Here's Mitrovic. That one off the back iron and out. Really high quality shot there. Just a little off with his release. That miss right there will definitely leave him shaking his head. They now take the lead. And Partizan leads by one. Good glass work there. Rebounds have been a little tough to come by for them in this quarter. Well, it looks to me like they're still finding their way out there, but it is early. Now, here is Nelson. From deep, and he gets it to go. Nelson's got seven. What a beautiful assist. That's a couple of teammates clearly on the same page. Here's Bogdanovich. Out to the right wing. The pass to Bertens. Let's it go from deep. Rebound by Shervanis Vesta. To the inside. Here's Nelson. No good. And Partizan will go the other way with it. 157 left to play in the first quarter. Here's Gagic. And poor shot selection there. Not a high percentage look for him. Launches it. The shot no good. Here's Bogdanovich. He's got six. Pass to Bertens. Here's Bogdanovich. Trains the three-pointer. Bogdanovich has got nine points. He's been one of their more reliable options today, guys. I mean, his shooting has led them to this lead. And Nelson gets it to go. Well, this quarter has gone awfully well for him. It seems like every chance he's gotten, he's pretty much converted. To the right side. Over to the wing. This one for three, and it's good. Clark, a lot of give and take between these sides early. Kevin, how about six lead changes in this half already? Yeah, good one here. Guys, this is going to be fun to watch. Two evenly matched teams, both teams playing hard. Great job to hit his teammate on that move, Kevin. To the left side wing. Here's Gagic. Another three for Partizan. That's three in a row, guys. Three three-pointers consecutively. These guys are just raining in shots. Yeah, the defenders can't be as soft as they've been on the perimeter there. Now, here is Nelson. Nine points in the game so far. Mitrovic. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. How about that? They respond to a three-pointer with a, a quick three of their own. Yeah, terrific. Great back-and-forth sequence right there. Pass to Bogdanovich. From past the arc, another three for Partizan. And the second quarter getting underway. No team gaining an edge so far. And a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for Partizan. You know, guys, we've really seen them do a lot of damage in the paint so far. And on top of that, they're really starting to knock down that long-range three ball tonight as well. Shervena Svesta trails by three. 
Here's Samanovic. His three pointers off the mark. Here's Westerman. Here's Milosav Lajevic. Down to five on the shot clock. Can't connect from 13 feet out. I'll tell you what, for what's really a, an elementary shot, he looked a little nervous on that release. Here's Samanovic. No good on the triple. The three. Rebounded by Partizan. And we're about a minute into the second quarter of play. Pass to Westerman. There's the pick. To the paint. Here's Pertinus. And it goes as the official calls the foul. Count it. He'll shoot one more at the free throw line. Boy, that was impressive, Clark. He did not hesitate to take the ball right up against the bigger defender. Boy, I like that aggressive mindset there, Steve. And so here is Shravena's Vesta. Six-point game. And here in the second with about a minute and a half gone by. Here's Westerman. And there's the pass to Laverne. Tries from 10. A second chance effort. Can't get it to go. And Shervena's Vesta at the other way now. Expanding his range. Rebounded by Partizan. Westerman's got three rebounds now in this one. Here's Kinsey. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. This is his first chance at the line tonight. And he makes the first. And Servina is best making a change. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Shervena is Vesta. Trails by six. Here's Schilb. Off target from three-point range. And here in the second quarter of action with a hair under two and a half minutes played so far. They set the pick. Bertinus passes to Westerman. Here's Laverne. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. Great job. Take it right at the defense. I like the aggressiveness. Yeah, he left him no choice but to foul there. For Partizan, they've made three free throws so far. Haven't missed any. And he sinks the second. You know, as we've gotten closer to halftime, their style has improved. It's gotten more aggressive, more physical. It sure seems like it has. They've spent a lot of time at the foul line this quarter. Can't cash in from close range. Ortiz on leading by seven. To the inside. Off with the layup. Pretty good defense there. I mean, that's a shot that he can make, but they really challenged him. Here's Ristich. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Here's Westerman. To the middle. Pass to Bertens. Unloads from nine, and Partizan misses again. And Shervena's Vest with possession. Only given up six here in this quarter, and that's going to be a travel. Well, this is what you have to do when you're trailing. You've got to attack, be aggressive, and get to that foul line. And perhaps cause some foul trouble along the way. I mean, that can have a big impact down the road. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Westerman passes to Bertens. Ball's knocked loose. Out of bounds, Ravenna's Vesta takes possession. Shervena's Vesta trails by four. The feed to Jenkins. 
And again, Trevino Zesta with a triple. And we've seen a few mix-ups defensively out there on the perimeter. More than a few. I mean, the open looks they've allowed from long range have turned into a lot of points. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. Yeah, the defender draped all over. Pretty plain and simple. Got him good there. For Partizan, they've shot 80% for the line tonight, going 4 of 5 so far. And the first one drops. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Here's Hutkovich. Got it. Good job in the low post. Here's Westerman. And there's the foul. It's against Shervanis Vesta. For Partizan, they've made six of their seven attempts at the line in this one. He misses the free throw. Nelson's checked in for Shervanis Vesta. And the second free throw, good. And Shervanis Vesta with possession. Nelson left side. And as it goes out of bounds, Cervenas Vesta able to keep the ball here. And Cervenas Vesta making a change. Here's Jenkins. He has six. Here's Marjanovic. No good. That would have tied it. Really good offensive execution. Nice pick. Just couldn't get the shot to go. Boy, you love to see that as a basketball purist. Guy setting a good screen and then getting the shot opportunity. Here's Blasic. He nails it. And we're tied up. He's got 12. And what jumps out at you guys, the assist totals. I mean, they have been dominant in that category. It's the ball movement, the player movement, a great rhythm to their offense. Clearly seems to me a different mindset between these teams. Intercepted. Passes it to Laverne. Here's Milosav Lahivic. Guarded by Nelson. Here's Westerman. And Partizan misses again. Now here's Jenkins. Good. Jenkins has got eight points. It looks like he's finding his touch now because the shots are starting to fall. There's the pass to Bertus. From 11 feet away, it's blocked. To the middle, here's Jenkins. And again, Shavino's Vesper. Seems that every pass they make is leading to a score here. I mean, that's just exquisite ball movement. Yeah, they're making the right play. They're working together, and they're just looking for the best shot they can every possession. Here's Westerman. To the middle. Pass to Laverne. Misses from close range. It just hasn't been a very good day for him, guys. They need him to start burying some of those. From the wing. And it's wide right. Hits off the rim. Well, I tell you what, that's too good a look to pass up there. Even though it didn't go, that's one you got to take. Here's Pertinus. Hands it from downtown. Six points for him. He's really starting to ramp it up now, getting involved in the offense here after being held without a point in the first. Here's Jenkins. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. Jenkins got the lead back up to four now for Shervanus Vesta. It's tipped. Here's Laverne. He has five, and he was fouled in the act of shooting. Chance here now for a three-point play. Well, he earned that one, took the hit, and still found a way to knock it down. Yeah, fantastic body control. And the will to get it done, you like that focus. So both teams changing it up here. For Partizan, they've made seven out of nine when they've stepped to the line. Here's Kadic. Back to Nelson. Here's Samanovic. 
They get it back. Kadich makes it off the glass. And Trevino's best leads by three. He got a great read of where that miss was going, and that allowed him to be the first guy to it and get the putback. Here's Westerman. That's good. Westerman's got his second bucket tonight. Now Nelson. Nine points in the game so far. The dish to Jenkins. Good! And a nice assist from Nelson. Jenkins got the lead up to four now for Shervenas Vesta. And it's Partizan now. Here's Gagic. And what was that about? Not a good shot right there. Rebounds are split just about down the middle in this game, Clark. I'd venture to guess whichever team is able to maintain that energy level on the glass will have the upper hand the rest of the way. Yeah, he's only one for five from the field this quarter. Not in rhythm at all. Partizan trails by six. They set the pick. Pass to Bogdanovich. Three-pointer. Good on the shot. Bogdanovich has got 15 points. D there, guys, was pretty much non-existent. I mean, you can't leave a good shooter like that open. Nelson, right side. Rebounded by Partizan. Laverne's got seven rebounds in the game. Passes it to Westerman. Almost, but it rolls out. You know, that's a problem he has. I mean, not being able to knock down that open jumper. I think it happens far too often. Here's Kadich. Misses from short range. A chance at a two-for-one if they want it. Yeah, no question. If I'm them, I'm definitely going two-for-one. 32 seconds left in the second quarter. Now the pass to Bogdanovich. And they're unable to get the time basket there. Nelson, right side. Here's Kadich. The layup missed. Here's Westerman. Here's Moosley. That misses, so no good on his first attempt of the night. Here's Jenkins. And the first half ends in a close one. Cervantes Vesta leads by three. We'll see you after halftime for the beginning of the third quarter. We have a close ball game on our hands as we get set for the second half of basketball been a stellar outing in this one for Jenkins. 16 points, and those four three-pointers he's hit have helped them, too. Well, they'd be in a much different position in this game if he wasn't burying those long balls. Misses from short range. Well defended, and he's not someone who responds well to that kind of defensive pressure. You know, one reason they're on top right now is that they haven't done a whole lot of what just happened there. Only a couple times have they given the ball away. Great defense. He anticipated the play and got there first. Yeah, I think he got there in time. Nice play. And it's Partizan now. Out to the wing. They set the pick. Here's Milosav Lajevic. Six to shoot. Stolen. Fast break. Here we go. Here's Nelson, and he jams it with authority. Boy, I love it. Active hands on the steal, active feet on the fast break. And Clark Power on the dunk. And guys, this is just too close of a game to be giving the ball up like that and then failing to get back in transition. And there's the whistle on the shot. Took the foul, shot misses. He'll be shooting two. Yeah, the defender draped all over. Pretty plain and simple. Got him good there. For Partizan, they've made their free throws at a pretty good clip. They've hit 8 of 10. And so he makes both from the line. Second half rolling along now. About a minute played here. 
Here's Blazic. And again, Shavino's Vesper. Here's Westerman. Here's Milosav Lahivich, guarded by Nelson. And Westerman kicks to Laverne. Bogdanovich passes to Laverne. Unloads from 13. Nice jump shot. Good. Laverne's got four points this quarter. Nelson outside. And a miss there on the triple. Partizan trails by three. Here's Bogdanovich. Throws down the breakaway jam. Boy, great job of attacking on the break. Yeah, it sure was. He made a beeline for the bucket as soon as they got the ball. Right away, straight to the rim. Now, here is Nelson. He's got 11. And they're going to count the bucket and send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. And they've made three of their first four shots here to start this half. And Zervena's Vesta making a change here. Even with that miss, they're shooting 75% coming out of the break. That's a strong start to the half. For Partizan, they've been getting it done at the line, 10 for 12. First one falls for him. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Guys, some great passing from him. Yeah, it makes it tough for the defense to chase that ball around when it moves that crisply all over the court. Yeah, it sure does, Clark. And look at the assist totals. They're piling up. I mean, this, is, this has been a, a nice game execution-wise for this club. Pass to Laverne. Here's Milosav Lahivich. Here's Milotinov. Oh, and there's the one-handed jam. Clark and Steve, neither side has relented a bit in this back-and-forth affair. Well, eight lead changes, Kevin, so far as the teams are battling it out here in the third. That's all building towards what could be a great finish. This will be fun to watch. Everything's going right now. Four for five shooting, 80%. They got their offense clicking. Deflects the pass, and he makes good on the layup. 13 points in the game. This game has taken on a new feel since halftime. For sure, the energy level on both sides has gone way up after the break. Nelson outside. Out to the right wing. Expanding his range. And again, Zervinas Vesta with a triple. That's two bombs in a row from long range. Yeah, shoddy defense there. Far too slow to react on the closeouts. Here's the screen. Inside. No good with the layup. Trevina's vest leading by three. Out to the right wing. Shot clock at six. Puts it up from 12. And again, Trevina's vest. Here's Westerman. To the middle. Here's Melatinov. The layup off target. Nelson outside. Down low. Marjanovic. Good. And a nice assist from Nelson. Nelson's got his seventh assist here tonight. You don't need much range to hit from that distance, Kevin. And Westerman kicks to Laverne. There's a good screen. Shot to stop the run. Nice fake with the layup off the mark. And here's Nelson. Here's Blazic. And again, Shavina's best. Now they're really doing a nice job of stringing together solid possessions and building that lead up. That's the key, Steve. They'll stay in control of this game if they can just avoid any lulls going forward. Here's Bogdanovich. He's got 17. And good on the basket. Book it. Bogdanovich has got four this quarter. Well, he's been a real positive factor for them today, although, you know, as a team, they've had a lot of negatives mixed in there as well. Here's Marjanovic. Count that one. And Shravenas Vesta leads by nine. A very hot shooting second half has seen them bring that field goal percentage way up. Yeah, they're cruising now, really looking to add to this lead, and this has been a clinic, Clark. Here's Bogdanovich. He's got 19. They set the pick. 
Westerman passes to Laverne. Shoots from 12. There's the bucket. Good. Laverne's got 14. Now, here is Nelson. He's got 16. Rebounded by Partizan. Westerman's got his sixth rebound on the night, and they're moving it up. Here's Bogdanovich. Here's Milosav Laivic, and that's good. A nice job in the glass as they pick up two on the second effort. Shervena's vest leading by five. Now Nelson. To the wing on the left. And again, the Shervena's vest. Well, I like the way he orchestrated in tight that time, fellas. Here's Westerman. Here's Milosav Lahivic. Guarded by Nelson. Here's Melatino. And he comes off the screen and slams it through. Well, that's a solidly executed pick play. I mean, it paid dividends with that nice dunk. Exactly the result they were looking for. Yeah, it worked so well. I mean, he got set and did not shuffle his feet. Really well done there offensively. Here's Marjanovic. Rebounded by Partizan. If he can improve on what's been a shaky day for him thus far, they could stretch this lead out. Misses from short range. And Shervena's Vest with possession. Leading by five. Rozic. No good on the three. Here's Westerman. Guarded by Nelson. Pass to Bogdanovich. Hits the three-point bomb. Bogdanovich has got 22. There you go. That's the stroke we saw in the first half. To the paint. Here's Radenovic. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. He's got 10. Oh, the rapid-fire three is coming from everywhere. I thought it might be a little imprudent to try to get those points right back, but it worked. Now, this is why the breakaway rim was invented, for plays just like that. Well, he almost brought the whole thing down, Clark, by hanging on that long. <laughs> yeah, he did, uh, didn't he? It was a great dunk and also a great game we've got here. Now, here is Nelson. He's got 16. Here's Radenovich. Offensive rebound. Here's Blazic. And the three ball is good. He's got 19. Good rebound there, but overall, they're, they're getting outworked on the glass. Steve, I think that's what you'd expect, seeing what the score is. Here's Milosav Lahivic to the middle. And Westerman kicks to Laverne. There's the screen. A nice shot by Bogdanovich. Bogdanovich has got nine points in the quarter. Seems like they're on their heels every time defensively because the ball continues to go into the post. Well, if they don't pick up the aggression, things are only going to get worse. Shervena's vest leading by four. Over to the left wing. And again, Shervena's vest with a triple. And D with very little pressure on their perimeter shooters. Three of the last five baskets they've allowed have been of the three-point variety. Yeah, and unless they make some rotations and closeouts defensively, there's more to come, Clark. And it's Partizan now. Here's Laverne. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Three-second difference between shot clock and game clock. Schilb, and again, Cervantes Vesta with a triple. Great outside shooting fueling this run. And the defense getting bombarded. They just haven't been able to slow them down. Here's Milosav Lahivic. Passes to Laverne. The three. No luck. Here's Schild. Misses there. Well, through three quarters of play, down double digits, it may be difficult to overcome. Cervantes Vesta out in front, ending the third quarter on a 12-4 run.
and fourth quarter basketball will be coming your way on 2K Sports right after this. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist of the game. Well, it had to be this play, don't you think, Kevin? Yeah, sure. This is just a phenomenal pass. Made the defense look like they had no idea what was going on. What precision with that pass. Beautiful. Trevena's vest leading by 10. Fade away. Shot's good. He hasn't really done much on the offensive end, but he's worked within the team concept to help them get the lead. He's done some other things other than scoring to help his team get the lead here. And there's the pass to Bertens. Inside. It's intercepted. They push it up for on three. Shot's good by Jenkins. And Trevena's vest leads by 14. Great looking bounce pass to set up that play. Over to the wing. Here's Pertinus. Gets it to go from beyond the up. There is no way. No way a player like him can be left wide open like that. Did you pay attention to the scouting report? Now here's Jenkins. Here's Kadic, shot clock at six. Here's Samanovic, off target with his three. He's normally a really big threat from long range. Struggling right now, he might need to mix his game up a little bit. Over to the wing, pass to Bertens. There's the steal. To the inside, and he takes the fantastic lead pass up strong for the slam. Well, this is how you completely rattle an opponent's rip. Yeah, you know, such terrific on-the-ball defense to trigger the transition opportunity. And it wasn't just a tough D. It was the exclamation point they put on the fast break with the slam. That's kind of his strong suit, the ability to find his way through the defense and finish at the rim. Here's Jenkins, and he comes it down. An indication there of why the scoreboard looks like it does. Very passive defense. But the finish was anything but passive. No, he hammered that down, Clark. Superb above the rim action. And it's Partizan now. Clock at six. Aganovic. Second chance shot. And they will get the basket here, folks, as they rule goaltending. He got there late, but you do have to like the aggressiveness to go after the block. But that one's going to count. Trevena's vest leading by 11. Kicks to Jenkins. To the left wing. There's the three. And he gets it to go. Jenkins got the lead up to 14 now for Shervanas Vesta. Boy, they've come out of halftime just smoking hot from behind the arc. Hey, trust me on this one, partner. They are going to continue to let him fly. How huge has he been, giving his team the lift. Without his work offensively, Steve, I don't know where they'd be. Shooting at great efficiency. I don't think they'd have a chance without him. And so here is Shervanas Vesta. And it's off from three-point range. Here's Pertinus, and fouled hard that time. He'll get to the line and shoot two. You know, even though they're down, they're putting on a show at the free throw line. This half. I think they've done a good job of making the most of their chances at the line, and they've got to keep it up to take the lead. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for Shervanus Vesper. Well, the great passing we saw in the first half has carried right over into the second. I've been impressed with how well they've penetrated tonight, too. And he makes both free throws. They're going to turn it over. They couldn't get it in bounds that time. Okay. 
a bit under three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Out to the wing. Pass to Bogdanovich. Just four to shoot. Out left to the wing. Here's Kinsey. And Partizan misses again. Trevina's vest leading by 10. To the paint. It's tipped. Pass to Bertans. And with that one, the lead is trimmed to single digits. Boy, the deeper we get into this game, the more offense we're seeing. And that goes for both teams, Steve. Everybody firing on all cylinders right now. And so here is Shravena Zesta. Here's Shilb on the money from 12 feet away. And Shravena Zesta leads by 10. And they have to mix it up defensively. That was just too easy. The pass to Bogdanovich. Pass to Bertans. Lets it go with a three. Can't get it to go. And Shervena's Vesta at the other way. Down low. Here's Jenkins. Blocked. And they're pushing it up. Up the floor. Here's Kinsey. And there's the rejection. And here's the break. Shots good by Jenkins. Jenkins got 25 points in the game. Partizan trails by 12. Analytics has become a huge part of the NBA, and one element of that that jumps out at me is basically the cameras that track every movement of every player and can provide info on when exactly a player gets tired to how much of their time on the floor they are actually running instead of standing around. And back to the camera system you were talking about, some teams using it more than others, but they are starting to find and use all sorts of uh, data, Steve, from those from those cameras. Yeah, it's interesting to, to hear how different teams are, are using that technology. Some teams use it to check on the club's spacing. We'll see how many times a guy is dribbling the ball compared to the season before. That's what the Celtics did with Rondo. It's really interesting. It's a tremendous amount of data to process, but the, the trick is, you know, making it work, making it mean something. Now, here is Nelson. Nelson, right side. Here's Radenovich. Well, good on the three. Partizan trails by eight. Here's Westerman. Here's Laverne. Sinks the three-pointer. Laverne's got five points now this quarter. He can be dangerous from outside. Sure, he didn't get one to go in the first, but we know he can get on a roll and knock him down. Great interplay there between those two teammates. And it's Partizan now. Westerman passes to Laverne. Passes it to Westerman. Let's it go from deep. Good D by Nelson. Some of the shots he's taken have been real head scratches. I mean, come on. He's out there playing like it's a game of horse at the park. Now here's Jenkins. Defense right on him. That free throw, no good. Both teams will make substitutions. Charles Jenkins. He hits the second from the line. Partizan trails by eight. And Westerman kicks to Laverne. Pass to Bogdanovich. Beyond the arc. Rebound by Shervanis Vesta. To the right side. Here's Jenkins. Here's Mojanovic. Lays it up and banks it in. That sort of epitomized this game, guys. One team going all out, getting rebounds and putbacks. And the other team just dragging Timeout called here for Tucson. NIS Belgrade decides to talk it over. Yeah, and 
Guys, I think he feels like he can make a few improvements during this timeout. Just kind of make a couple of adjustments, get his club back on track. You know, coaches are always tweaking and tinkering with things mid-game. Actually, sometimes they overdo it. Let's find out what Doris Burke has for us. Hi, Kevin. The head coach for the visiting team had some instruction for his guys during that last break. He was emphatic. We're not getting it done, fellas. We've simply got to step up, get engaged, and try to battle back. Guys, we'll see if the pep talk gets him going. Jenkins can't get it to go. That's one he knows he should have made. Here's Westerman. Launches a three. It's blocked, and he's able to get it back. Six on the shot clock. Inside, Nelson with the steal. Here we go, one-on-one. -on -one. Here's Blasich. Off with the layup. That's the kind of defense required when he's got the ball near the hoop. And they were right in his face. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time getting the lid off the basket so far. The timely screen gave him a step, and he took it all the way. He has not lost his focus today. Even when things haven't gone his team's way, he's still bringing it. Ball stolen. Here's Westerman. The pass to Laverne. Here's Westerman. There's a screen. Three-pointer. Laverne. A follow-up flush. Well, I love that aggression. Forget about the tip. Just grab the thing and slam it home. Well, what a way to get second chance points. Man, don't take any risks. Just put that ball back in the hoop. Now, here is Nelson. 109 left here in the fourth quarter. Shot clock at six. From beyond the arc, they get it back. Adrenovic. Well, the big fella's showing us a little explosiveness for the change. Well, maybe Brock is working on his dunk skills because he looked perfectly at home right there. Yeah, sometimes he can frame those, so I'm glad to see him get that one down. Timeout called here. Partizan, NIS Belgrade, decides to talk it over. They're behind by eight. There's 57 seconds left in the game. Laverne offline with his three. I'll tell you what, the defense has nothing to worry about out there with him shooting. I mean, he can't dial it in from deep this half at all. That's good. Well, this is going to seal the deal. They've really exploded here to the finish line. You know, once they sniffed out that blood in the water, the killer instinct came right out. No luck. And Shervena is Vesta the other way now. They've led by as many as 14 points. Nelson. Nelson with another miss. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. There's the pick. To the inside. It's stolen by Jenkins. Knocks it loose. And I think this is going to be too much to overcome, Clark. What do you think? All the sand in the hourglass is gone, and I agree with you. And he gets the bucket. You know, when the size advantage is that pronounced, I mean, that's exactly what you should do offensively in this situation. Take it strong to the middle. Here's Radenovic. Off target with that shot. And so Cervantes takes the win. They came, they saw, they conquered. Hey, Kevin, to me, any win is a good win. That about does it for Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Doris Burke, and the rest of our great crew. This is Kevin Harlan saying so long, and thanks for watching. Now, here is our Jordan player of the game.